What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Cartopia, aka the hub for all things automotive. Today, we're going to take a look at another top five list. If you've read the title, you already know today we're going to be looking at my list of the top five fun sports cars under $10,000. This list is in no particular order, so just keep that in mind. 1. The 2006 Infiniti G35 Coupe Now, the G35 Coupe is probably a car that you've seen in many different instances if you've been around the car community for a little while. It's usually heavily modified, sometimes slammed, but most importantly, always enjoyed. These cars can be a ton of fun to customize and modify. The stock power isn't too bad either, boasting 298 horsepower and 260 pound-feet of torque. Out of its naturally aspirated 3.5-liter V6, it's no wonder this thing will pull you 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 5.5 seconds. Fitted with an optional 6-speed manual and rear-wheel drive, this combination makes for an extremely fun ride. Now, the one you find for under 10,000 might have a few miles and mods on it, but you got to admit, for what you're getting, that's a heck of a deal. 2. The 4th Generation Chevy Camaro Z28 Switching gears slightly from our last car on this list is something a little more American. Now, if you know anything about Camaros, you know that they're generally loud, proud, and a boatload of fun, especially when it comes to the Z28 models. The 1999 Z28 Camaro comes with a 5.7-liter V8 engine that puts out 305 horsepower and 335 pound-feet of torque. All of that power is conveniently sent to the rear wheels, making it pretty easy to get sideways in this thing. Now, with its age, it's normal for cars to lose some of their power, but these cars can easily be brought back to life with a few bolt-on parts. And the best part? Parts are plentiful and cheap, too. All of this for under $10,000 is hard to pass up, especially if you like old-school cars. 3. The 2007 Lexus IS250 Doing a complete 180 from the last car, we have this Japanese legend. The Lexus IS is one of the more beloved cars in this segment. One of the people's favorite things about this car is simply its reliability. Compared to other cars in this segment, such as the BMW 3 Series or the Audi A3, neither of them come anywhere near the IS250 regarding reliability. This is because of Lexus and Toyota's high standard of vehicle development, with their heavy emphasis on longevity and sustainability. If you take care of this car, it will take care of you. Aside from its stellar reliability, its performance isn't too bad either. Coming in with 204 horsepower and 185 pound-feet of torque, it's not the fastest car by any means, but it's definitely got a little bit of pep in its step. You can find these cars for less than $10,000 pretty much anywhere, and it's definitely worth your consideration. 2. The NB or NC Mazda MX-5, aka the Miata. Now, there are really two types of people in the car community, Miata haters and Miata lovers. But even if you're a hater, if you've ever gotten the chance to drive one, you cannot deny that these zippy little two-door sports cars are a ton of fun to drive. Sure, it might not be too practical or too fast or too comfortable either, but despite all this, people still love these cars. It makes you wonder, what could it be? I think a big part of it comes down to personality. The car is just unique. There aren't too many cars that are fun, cheap, unique, and nice to look at available, to be honest. The NB and NC models are the second and third generation of the Miata, and depending on options, you could easily find either generations for under 10000 If you don't consider it a contender either, I'd recommend you drive one. You might just change your mind. 1. The 2010 Hyundai Genesis Coupe this is a car that some of you might not have thought would have been on this list, because so often it gets forgotten. But the Genesis Coupe is a great car and I think is a little bit underrated in my opinion. Coming with either a 2.0-liter turbo 4-cylinder or a 3.8-liter naturally aspirated V6, either model is an extreme amount of fun. Keep in mind, with a budget of 10000 you will likely have to find a 3.8 model with a few more miles on it, whereas you will have more options when opting for the 2.0 with that budget. With 210 horsepower and 223 pound-feet of torque, the 2.0-liter gets you moving, and it's easy to squeeze more power out of that engine since forced induction motors are really simple to make more horsepower and torque through tuning and a few simple modifications. 
For these reasons, I think this car is a fantastic option if your budget is set right around $10,000. Not to mention the fact that this car generally looks pretty great. Some wheels and a fresh new paint job and this thing is ready for any car show. So that's all the time we have today. Thanks so much for swinging by Cartopia. If even one ounce of you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, hit the like button, and make sure to turn notifications on for new videos. I will be posting more in the future, so be on the lookout. And be sure to comment if you have any ideas for any videos you want to see.